W U K. My name is Nate. My name's MJ. My name's Gossie. Today we are reviewing limited edition firework audios. Uh, I don't know why, but some of my American friends seem to be sharing quite a lot of. Um, what you like <laughs> just, just keep doing it. Just and I just saw his reaction. There seems to be quite a few American products at the moment that are um, doing the whole sort of Black and big white American thing. thing. I don't know if it's, oh, just now, now I'm thinking about it, it's probably Independence Day linked. Yeah, probably. Um, so they don't do it normally, there's a lot of red, white, and blue products out there at the moment. Anyway. It's the 30th of June when we're filming this. Yeah, so there's a few days. By the time you're watching this, have you had a good ID for? No, that's the film Independence Day. Um, thank you to my friend Emo Kev. Eric and Bailey, 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 not Bailey, Cheers, Bailey, Bailey, Cheers, Bailey. Eric Bailey, Bailey, Eric Bailey, Eric Bailey, Eric Bailey, Eric Cheers, Bailey, Eric 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 Interested. Yeah, popping candy is a good thing. Oh, they look fantastic. Wow. Oh, they smell wonderful because they smell like Oreos. Dossie loves Oreos, so we know he's going to give them at least a five star. Dead thing. Dead biscuit. Not as good as a bourbon. Oh, bloody love Oreos. Oh, wow. It tastes, it tastes a little different. It does to me. It tastes a bit more birthday cakey. Mmm. Mmm. Love it. Absolutely nothing is popping in my mouth right now. Yeah, definitely not. It is actually quite a mild pop. Oh, oh yeah. I really love Oreos. Yep. My bad, there is a slight pop. Yeah, at the back. A very minuscule pop. There's loads in there. Like, it should be popping up crazy. Mm. Popping like crazy. Popping up. Oh, really? Yeah, maybe, that is. Just, maybe it's just because I haven't had an Oreo in ages. I'm really enjoying it. No, I love it. There's definitely something a bit birthday cake about yeah. them, but not like full. They, they, they smell different and they taste better than a normal Oreo. Really crunchy as well. Actually, one thing, to be fair, I don't think I've had an, an, an American normal Oreo. Because I've never, like, i am like, well, we've got that in the UK. So I've always just got a limited edition one. Right. Um, so I wonder if this actually is just a normal US Oreo, in which case, even better than ours. That's, that's, a, that's a double take, that is. I fucking love Oreos, mate. I love them. Mm. And these are the best fun. The colour looks great. And yeah, a bit of crackers. Yeah, we love them. I, I agree. I, 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 like I said, I don't know whether it's just because I haven't had them for a while. Or there is a slight difference. <laughs> Oh no, you silly fool, there's a lift thing that I should have used. Banger. Um, but I actually enjoy that a lot more than usual. The chocolate in the biscuit seems to be quite strong as well. Like a nice dark chocolate flavour. Mm. Love it. Really love it. Yeah. I mean, the popping candy adds very little, really. It's not. The popping is, is, is not quite subtle, but it's a gimmick. For uh, say the, the firework element of it, sweet. Um, I like it. I, mean, I really like it. I've really enjoyed that. Five stars. <laughs> yeah, flavour is incredible. Dark, sweet cocoa biscuit. The cream, like we say, feels like something else there. Either a bit of vanilla or birthday cake. Something is there. And you've got the additional fun from the pop and candy. Texture as well, it's, it seemed like a smoother cream. Yeah, softer. Yeah. Ah, oh, six stars for me. And that's the end of the review. Thank you all for watching and uh, subscribe and like. No negativity here. Not, not even negative. No. Really nice biscuit. Good. Oh, wow. Yeah, it's a nice biscuit. Really right. nice biscuit. Good flavours. Love the taste of the cream. Um, Probably the most enjoyable Oreo I've had, possibly. Don't quote me on that. Oh wow! But yeah, it was a, it's a, you know, it's a brilliant biscuit. Um, the popping candy is very minuscule, but actually, I think I probably prefer it that way.
Um, yeah, I, I agree actually, I don't think I would want it hugely, it would be a bit too much of a distraction. Hmm. For me it's a very, very high fall. Fucking hell. Oh, wow, that's a far cry from this. No. You like Oreos, you fucking idiot! <laughs> you like Oreos, you fucking idiot. It's a nice biscuit. No, fair. I love, I love this. It's a nice biscuit. Brilliant. Bourbon meats. There's something on your head. Well, it ain't fucking hair, mate. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what, like an insect? Can you zoom in? No, it's not an insect, it's not living. Whereabouts is it? Dead thing, dead thing. It's a dead thing. <laughs> yeah, right on the old forehead, yeah. Can you see it? I don't know what I'm looking Can you for. See it? No. I can't see it on the viewfinder. Hang on, let me. I'll take care of this. Go over a bit. Oh, there it is. There. Can you see it there? No. Oh, yeah. Just here. Yeah, that's it. Look. That was a fun game for the viewers. <laughs> this is good, isn't it? <laughs> It's good because you're zooming out on It's good and it's weird. I mean, when MJ calls you weird. It's when you know you're fat. Memes. I didn't meme it. <laughs> Thanks very much for watching. Check out Michael Jameson Comedy for videos like Would You Rather? Would you? And talk buds like this one, which is an old one because we probably won't film one today. Goodbye. What beaties would you like, little boy? What beaties would you like in your bag? Bah! <laughs>